संजय महाराष्ट्र मी मनाली दिवसभर महत्वा घड़ोड़ं पर नजर टाक आहोत सुरुआती बारी पहा आहोत याकूब मेमन सदर्भतली याकूब मेमन यीस जुलाईला फाशी देना है परंतु यपूर्वी तेने एक ही शिक्षा सुनावने आधी तेने का मध्यमांशी तीन प्रसार मध्यम एक मुलाखत दी होती है या घटने बाबत या बॉम्बस्फोटाशी संबंधित खुलासा देखी के होता ऐकूत अपन का नेमक याकूब मेमन Who was the brain? Behind? Brain was Pakistan government. ISI, what they call. Mm -hmm. And what did they do? They supplied arms, explosives. Who told you? Tofik Jalia Wala told me this. That the Pakistan. Yes, that ISI... he used to boast. Then mm. I have done a very good job. That this way we had planned everything, and we dictated. What did he say? What did Tofik Jalia Wala say to you? Tofik Jalia Wala told about me about the bomb blast. Yes, about the bomb blast. What did he say? That. Uh, I have supplied the arms, explosives, and I have dictated the spots. You know, because Tiger, I had given the work to execute. Tiger, with his boys, have executed the blast, and I had done everything. I mean, supplying of arms, explosives, and dictating the spots. Pakistan want did what they wanted. What did in they want? Taking what the did name Pakistan of, want? See, Pakistan wants. to create trouble in india and to do all those things which harms government of india and people of government people of india be the muslim or hindu it is not their concern they are just interested in creating trouble in india they saw the situation in january riots that muslims have a bit so of they saw this whenever pakistan will get this type of occasion they will definitely give trouble to our country definitely If they'll get a chance to slap even one of our person, they will do that. They are up to this, and they are appealing the international. They are seeking support from international Muslims that our Muslim brothers in India are being to tortured. Association is done is done to them, and this way they are taking sympathy from them. Do you know Javed Chikna? I've heard his name. He is also in Pakistan. And Ijaz Patan? Ijaz Patan is also in Pakistan. Did they go with you? No. You met them there? No, I haven't met them. I had just the information about their whereabouts, and how did you? What information? How did you get it? I got from this Tiger's driver, Shafi, who became a you know. I developed friendship with him to go get all the information from him. And these these two men are still there. Yes, yes, they are there. And they are also rehabilitated by. Yes, Pakistan. they are re rehabilitated by Tofi. They also have, uh, they have Pakistani passports. Pakistani passports. Passport. Identities. They have identity cards. They stay in a flat over there. In fact, some of the boys are staying at Tofi's bungalow. Some of the Rufi boys cottage. meaning who are Means, these? I don't remember their names. You know, some Teda Meda, some names are there. Yaku Beda, Daud Ibrahim. According to Tofi, he is there. He is But in Pakistan. I have never met him. He is in Pakistan. You have never met him in your life. Never in my life. Never in my life. On seventeenth, we have boarded a PIA flight. For it was to land at Dubai via Karachi. But we were escorted by a Pakistani agent at Karachi airport without any. immigration and formality we was escorted out of the the sky the azam airport karachi airport by pakistani agent you mean whom asif is his name was he was a bald fellow he escorted us right from inside the airport to outside and your passports were they stamped no no formalities of any immigration or customs were Complete. A Pakistani official came, took you off the flight, and yes. took you without any formalities. Right, through. right. And your passports were given to him. Did you give him your Indian passport? Yes, he collected our Indian passport. The very first thing he did, he collected our Indian passport. He escorted us outside the airport then, without any formality. You did not have your Pakistan, uh, your Indian passport with you then. Yes. Since then, after one year, we received our Indian passports. Where were you taken then, by Asif? Uh, from there, from airport, we were taken to one Tofik Jaliawala's bungalow in Karachi. It is in Dharaji Colony. And you stayed there. Yeah, we stayed there. The whole family. 
not whole family because on 17th myself my wife father mother and uh, younger brothers had shifted there by 20 or 21st rest of the members joined us at the same place in the bungalow taken to bangkok on uh, 17th april uh, those was the time you know i had realized what has happened before that neither myself nor any member of the family had the slightest you know inkling about all these things but when after all reaching is this bomb blast mm -hmm. and the conspiracy behind this mm -hmm. so you got to know about it in bangkok not in bangkok mm -hmm. after reaching karachi i see and when you went to bangkok who accompanied you uh bangkok we uh, captain sawar his name was alias usman he was a government official he accompanied us yes a pakistani government official what was his name he used to tell usman hmm. but later i came to know that his name is captain sawar where did you stay in bangkok bangkok we were taken to a bungalow at some pataya road and then we were confined to a house we didn't move anywhere they you used didn't to stay serve. in a hotel on 16th some of the members had gone they stayed in hotel indra regency mm -hmm. i went on 17 we joined them and then we were taken to a bungalow at pataya road there we stayed for around up to 29th april 29th kept your expenses in uh, in ba in bangkok i think this pakistani officials tofik and tiger had arranged a plot of land for a new house at karachi development scheme how many uh, what was the size of it it was 1000 yards a very spacious plot was there and how much did you pay for it around 60 lakhs rupees 60 lakhs yes and who paid for it tiger tiger and tofik used to pay all the funds was given by tiger and tofik 